everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I finally have another Invisalign update for you. I'm so honored that some of you are really following along on my Invisalign journey. I am on my seventh month of Invisalign and 35 week tray. So I have been doing this since October and a few months ago I went back um, to do my regular checkup and uh, the dentist or the orthodontist basically said that they, oops, the orthodontist basically uh, said we were going to take a little break while they re, while they made my next series of trays. So I had one retainer that I wore only at night and I didn't need elastics and I didn't need um, any other gear. It was just the trays for 12 hours a day. So I was thinking that I was pretty close to the end and I went in two days ago um, the orthodontist then gave me my next series, which is 10 more trays. So I have 10 more weeks. Previously, up until this point, I was switching my trays out every other week, but the trays that I have, I'll be switching out every week. I will go back to wearing elastics to help with my bite. So basically what the orthodontist said was that this last kind of set of trays are going to be what really refines my teeth and really does that the small amount of adjusting to make them perfect. They look great. I'll do a close-up after. Um, I'm not 100% happy with them because they're not perfect, um, but I can see them getting there and I'm really, really excited to see the difference and see the change. I'm very happy that I decided to do Invisalign. So if you're looking at uh, fixing your teeth and you're, you're you know, trying to figure out the different types of options, I think Invisalign is probably the best only because it's flexible, as in you can take the trays out at uh, when you eat, when you brush your teeth, that sort of thing. There's minimal pain. I would say when I had braces, my teeth would ache a lot more. Here I find it's maybe one day and then I feel fine the next day. My only issue that I'm having right now with my teeth is that what has happened was um, a few weeks ago I started getting a lot of pain in the back of my mouth at my last tooth, that molar back there in between the gums. It wasn't the tooth, it was the gum. And it felt like food was getting up there and it really hurt and every time I would floss it, it would be so excruciatingly painful and it would bleed like crazy. So I thought maybe I had an infection or I didn't, maybe I cut it. I had no idea and it did this for weeks. And I went to the dentist um, the day before my orthodontist appointment and basically what the dentist said, when you go through something like Invisalign, sometimes your teeth are shifting which leaves gaps in your teeth and probably because I was on one tray for so long, it kind of created a gap and food was just getting up there, whether it was like cutting it or just staying up there, and my gums were getting irritated. So they actually went in there and cleaned it all out. There was surprisingly nothing in there. I'm very proud to say I took a very good job. I was using mouthwash. I even flossed through the pain, and they helped relieve some of the pressure, and it feels much better now. They said once I switch trays, it'll probably really help, and I did switch trays, and I have noticed that it's been less painful, so I hope that that's the end of that debacle because that was very annoying for the past few weeks. I couldn't chew on the side of my mouth. Other than that, I'm loving it. Invisalign is absolutely amazing. I'm sorry for my light. It's like in and out, light and dark. Um, I'll show you. They gave me this time the box of trays. These are the bags that it comes in. Um, this says one out of 13. The dentist has 13, or the orthodontist has 13, but says he thinks we'll probably go up to 10, which I'm not mad about. Um, then, and I got, so they come in these individual packets. Typically what I try to do is I try to write in the note section, done, and then I put the old tray in, just in case. I also, they gave me some elastics and some chewies, and if you don't know what chewies are, Chewies, Walter loves these. He finds them and he takes them, which is not good. I find them all chewed up. Oh, this one's different. Is you actually they're like squishy. And so sometimes when you have a new tray, it's really hard to get them up there. So you just bite on that and it pushes them in. I'll put in my new trays for you and 
I will then show you a close-up of my mouth. Okay, so I'm going to show you uh, me putting in the trays. These ones are really tight because they're brand new. So I just go like this. Clip them in the bottom. Then you hush the front hushed. And that's how they sit and I don't start using elastics until next week because I haven't been uh, using them to talk as much. I'm having a little bit of trouble with my S's and th. Um, but yeah, so that's what they look like on and then I'll show you a close up of my teeth with them off. So this is my teeth up close. They are looking really good. I'm so happy with them. The only thing, so this, there's still a gap right here. So they're bringing this forward and they're gonna straighten it up. And this side's looking really good. This is straight, but they need to uh, move these around. So that is, uh, those are my teeth, so I hope that you enjoyed this video. I will link all my other Invisalign videos down below if you're interested in watching them. I think that it is an amazing way to fix your teeth and it is worth every penny. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button down below and I will see you again for another video. Bye.